Get low, okay, you beautiful people of the internet. It is me, Benjamin A. Camjo. Welcome back to a brand new video. No, I am not shooting. I'm not gonna make that joke. Anyways, <laughs> I was about to make a bad joke, but let's not. Let's let's not. So you're probably wondering, why is my bed empty? In reality, I'm just cleaning everything, and I have to clean my room. So I'm gonna just quickly show you because I'm gonna show you how impressively awesome my editing skills are. So here's my room. It's really bad, I know. I don't really want to show you guys, but now I'm just gonna do with some magic, a magic little clap, all right, guys? This magic clap, and it's gonna all change. All right, guys, I even changed my shirt for you guys. That's how committed I am to my editing. Anyways, I'm gonna show you guys my room now, because it looks way better. It's actually took me only like half hour to do. This is my pajama stuff, so don't worry. I'm also still washing my sheets. This part, I clean all the bottles and everything, except for that one, because it's still full. So I'm gonna use it, I'm gonna drink it. Uh, I do need to organize this a little bit better though. But all my clothes are now off the floor, and they're all hung up. Oh my gosh. All right, guys, I hope you guys like that transition. It's so good, my camera needs to go back to focus. There we go. Anyways, I'm gonna, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me get in my car first. All right, so my plan for the night is I'm going over to E Dog's house. Ethan, we all love Ethan. We all know Ethan. Going over to his house, and I'm going to hang out with him till whatever time because I have school tomorrow morning. That's fun. But hopefully, we can go drive around for a little bit and see what happens from there. I just need to touch grass because I literally haven't touched grass like all day today. Okay. Like, not. I did. We all know that's a metaphor. I need to stop being so, like, overthinking literal. But I need to touch grass, so I'm just going to leave the house, enjoy for a little bit. I know it's, like, 9 o'clock, but I'm going to, you know, be out for, like, two hours, maybe. Ugh, time to go to school. You guys can't even see my face. Oh, my gosh. It's actually embarrassing. Hey, guys. I finally made it to school. I'm just walking to class right now. I am beyond tired. Like always, I feel like I say that every video, which I am, but we're here. Hold on, let me show you the campus. First, you guys have already seen this. All right, you guys, I am outside the campus, as you can see. Wait, you guys can't really see. Anyways, okay, so I just had class, and this is really weird because there are people around me. Anyways, I just had class, and now I have something due on Thursday called the elevator pitch. Basically, I have to come up with a three to five minute movie where I have to come up with a three to five minute movie about basically anything. It could be like a documentary kind of thing, Whatever, but I was thinking, because something that changed my life a lot has been roller skating, and you know, we all know Destiny, everything. So I was thinking that I can make a movie based on that. It's gonna be a lot of idea planning. I, but you know, ChatGPT is also really cool. So we'll have to see what happens. But I am, uh, yeah, I don't really know what to say about that, but three to five minute movie, I have to be creative. So it's gonna be great. All right, guys, as you know, I'm a very creative person, very creative. All right, well, it is really hot outside, so I'm going to go in my car and go home and take a nap. So just want to let you guys know about the elevator pitch. All right, 
I'll see you guys all in a second. All right, guys, I am back. That's why they call me Sim Shady. I'm back. Uh, I am currently in a place called Highland, Utah. Um, homeboy over here, he's shirtless, but I mean, he's got a he's got a good body, so he can go on camera. Home, homeboy over here just cleaned my car. And let me give you guys a quick tour of how it looks. I got, boom, the driver's seat. Looks amazing. Look at that. Except that I just put that drink there, okay, guys? I don't want anyone in the comments saying he didn't do a good job. That was me. That was me. And then, there's that. I have a ton of water bottles I need to deal with. Because, you know, we got to conserve water, so you just put them there. Look at the seats, though. Oh, my gosh. The trunk looks good, I promise. <laughs> I don't want to open it. And then this part right here, and then if you're wondering what that is, it is a swig card. And then here's this part. Shoot! Shoot! And then there's me, being a little dork. I was actually, guys, I'm gonna show you right now. I was out of it. By the way, this crotch is massive. This this chair right here is probably my new best friend. I passed out on this chair for maybe like an hour. That was great. I feel like a whole new world. All right, well, you guys, I'm gonna go home now and take another nap, so. It's specifically designated for a very special manager named Jaden. Jaden, I know you're watching this. This is for you, okay? For you. I made this for you! Now, she got upset with me because I didn't mention her in my last video which is when the meeting happened and everything. I was talking about the meeting and like uh, me being upset with how everything came out to be. But I told her, I was just like, hey, why would I mention you if you never upset me? But you know what? She was so determined to be featured in one of my videos that I had to do this. <laughs> Let me tell you a little bit about homegirl Jaden. Yeah. That's how I feel right now. That That is how I feel right now. I've known Jaden for a couple months now. She just came to the Mid Village. She went for, she went to my location where I worked, and now she's going back to her original location. Woo! And it was really funny because today what happened was here. Let me finish what happened with the story. So basically, she said she was like watching all my videos with uh, with her brother and everything. She was like, "Yo, Benjamin, like I'm really upset. You never like mentioned me at all that you're upset after the meeting." And I was just like, "Okay." I was like, "But like, why would I be upset with you?" Anyways, so I just want to dedicate this whole clip just for her. So Jaden, this is just for you, as I already mentioned. Basically, today it was really funny. So my friend Robert. He works with us. Robert, if you're watching this, hi, good morning. Um, it is 1 a.m. when I'm recording this and I have school in like six hours, but who's counting? Seven hours. So Robert, my friend Robbie, Robert, Robert, Roberto, whatever. I call him Roberto just because it's funny. But basically he had pulled me to the side and he was like, hey, can you grab this person? And I was like, okay. So I grabbed him. I grabbed that person and then out of nowhere, I was told by Jaden, my manager, to go hop on bird. Which, if y'all know what that means, that just means you're dropping, you're making, you're yeah. cooking food, really. That's, that's as simple as I can put it. Just dropping bird, that's really it. Chicken, okay. And then, out of the freaking blue, I sat there, I kid you not, all right, I kid you not. I had to write this on my script, by the way, on my phone, so I didn't forget this part. But basically, what happened was Robert and uh, everyone came, and I was sitting here with an apron on, just like minding my own business, right? I have no idea what's going on, just because, you know, I kind of just came in to help out for a little bit, and also because it was her last day working at that location. That was my last time ever working with her. So I kind of decided to, you know, I was like, yo, I'm gonna come visit, and then if I need to get work, then I can work, you know? And so I came in to basically just to say bye to her because, you know, she means a lot to me. And <laughs> it's really funny because everyone and their dog had one of those like party like kazoots. Does everyone, does, is everyone catching up with the story here? So there was like, what, five people? Everyone had a kazoo, okay? And you know, the ones that you blow are like, woo, woo, 
like you know, like when it's a New Year's, it's like Happy New Year, woo! Like I can't really do the sound effect because it's like really hard to mimic. But what happened was I was literally right behind Jaden. Jaden, I know you're laughing right now, you little scumbag. <laughs> so I was literally right behind Jaden, and out of the blue, I just hear all these like the I don't remember what they're called. I think that, that, I'm just gonna call them like um party cassettes or whatever the i don't you know like the when it, that's like new year's you like blow it because it's a new year's uh, it's a new year you know what i'm talking about i'm pretty sure i don't remember what it's called but they were blowing that and i was like what the freak and out of nowhere i see i'm literally sitting behind no idea what the freak is going on okay no idea and here are here's the whole entire crew just like bringing her a whole thing of baskets flowers everyone's recording i'm just like what the freak is going on right now and i was like you guys i've never there is times in my life where i have felt this included in things <laughs> and tonight <laughs> was one of those nights where i felt beyond this included holy smokes i literally just sat there and i'm just like I was like, what am I supposed to do? I had no idea what was going on. I was, it was just really, wow. I felt super awkward just because I was just standing there not knowing what the crap to do. Because I was like, I didn't know they had this thing planned. They had planned it out like earlier that shift, but like I just had got there. So like I was just kind of just lost. I really feel like I wasn't, I mean, I'm going to be honest with you at the time when that was happening i felt like an absolute scumbag because <laughs> he was just sitting there with like nothing to offer and i was like what the freak <laughs> so i was like oh my gosh so anyways that was fun Jaden, stop laughing okay that's not very nice i'm gonna talk to you guys about how much she means to me all right, <laughs> all right. <laughs> i mean <laughs> Jaden, you better you better love me after this i'm making a whole clip for you okay good golly anyway <laughs> So basically, she means a lot to me. I met her a couple months ago. She literally just transferred to our store and I was like, what the freak? I was like, hi, random person. And she ended up being like one of my favorite people. I don't know, she was just a vibe, you know? She reminded, I told, <laughs> I told her, I was like, Jaden, I was like, you know who you remind me of? I was like, you know, you know what you are or whatever. And I don't remember exactly how the conversation went, but this is like paraphrasing. She's like, I was like, Jane, if I was a white girl, I would literally like, you would be me. Or like, if I were, cause like, I'm really annoying and obnoxious and everything. But I literally told her, I was like, if I were to be a white girl, just pure white, you would literally be me. <laughs> cause we literally have like the same personality. It's hilarious. She's, she says she's not obnoxious and everything. I just think she's fun and adorable to listen to and everything she's she's so fun i love her but sorry gene i love you all right as a friend platonically so it was just man it was great but i really i love jaden she was a great manager she's going back to her og location and yeah i'm just uh i just want to show my appreciation to her as a manager and as a as a former co-worker or employee of hers i think that's what you say so jaden I really do appreciate you. <laughs> I really enjoyed making this clip too. I appreciate you for, <laughs> for giving me this idea from getting mad at me yesterday for not mentioning you my video. So now here's this whole segment for you. And now I want you guys to know that uh, she will be in my next videos. Okay, she will be coming soon in my videos. She's dieharding to like come in my videos. She's like, Benjamin, I want to be one of your videos. Uh, maybe we should make a podcast together. And I'm just like, why does everyone the dog want to make a podcast with me? Like, what the freak? Like, why? Like, I'm not that, like, there's nothing entertaining about me. Okay, well, there, there, there's really not. I don't, like, I don't know why you guys watch on this or are watching this video. But no, she was like, I want to be like a, in a podcast with you and everything. And I was like, okay. I just was like, why does everyone want to do a podcast with me? Like, what the freak? <laughs> like, I'm not that cool, guys. Like, I really am not. All right. And it's like, but, oh my gosh, it's the YouTuber. Oh my gosh, it's Benjamin. I'm, I'm not that cool. All right, relax. So I just want to let you know, though, she is going to be in my upcoming videos. She wants to tour Utah with me. She's lived here all her life. But she's like, what part of Utah have you not visited? I'm just like, dog, I don't even leave my basement. And she was like, heard that. Which is... If you know, you know the joke behind that. So she basically said, she's like, yeah, let's like go somewhere, you know, like you can record a video and whatnot. And I was like, 
I'm like, dude, I'm super down. Let's do it. I was like, I would love to make a video with you. It'd be so much fun. And yeah, no, um, just expect to hear soon one of my videos. This is actually a picture of her. As you can tell, she took up basically the whole entire picture. I know, Jane, I know you're laughing. I know you're laughing, scumbag. And yeah, can everyone please also I was gonna I wanna ask everyone if they can comment in this in the if they can write in the comments below. We love you, Jaden. Can you guys do that? That'd be amazing. Just to show, just to prove to her how much she means to me. I want at least 10 con. I don't know. I really don't know. Just comment down, all right? And I'll like it, all right? That's all I ask for this video. Just comment, we love you, Jaden. Hey guys, this is gonna be the end of the, this is gonna be the last clip of the video. I know a lot of weird things have been going on. That's why I just, Everything's gonna go back up to date here really soon. I apologize, just know that I've had a very hectic week. But I added this in a video, I put this in a video, but I just decided to cut it out sort of because it was super long already, but I'm gonna basically just summarize it right quick because this will be the last part. But basically my official last day, I was scheduled to work with Jaden. Uh, we gave each other a hug and for some reason that was like one of the most heartwarming best hugs I've ever received. So I just wanna mention that, that it was like, wow. Like it was so good I texted her. I was like, wow, that hug was amazing. But no, she's awesome. I love her to death. And I love her more if she could actually, you know, text me back. I hope that made you feel awkward because I purposely did that. But anyways, that's gonna be all for this video. Road, uh, just subscribe if you're new. Uh, my videos, I'm trying to make them better. It's just life is getting crazy. So uh, yeah, I'm really tired. Sorry guys. Anyways, I'm gonna I'm gonna go to bed now. But uh, Jaden, uh, you should text me back when you have the chance. I'm just I hope I'm embarrassing you in front of all my subscribers. That's really it. Anyways, I love you guys all so much, and we're close to 5K, so let's do it. And yeah, um, just better videos hopefully it will come it will come i promise i'm just so dead on the inside so all right that is enough for me speaking today i'll see you guys all soon so hopefully this will be uploaded really really soon Spirit, leave me where my trust is with